Hello everyone. Thanks for joining us. I am Piyush Malwal and in this video we will be talking about biofortified varieties in India. Along with we will be talking mainly about what makes them different from traditional varieties. So first let's know about what is biofortification. Biofortification is the process by which nutritional quality of food crops is improved through agronomic practices. conventional plant breeding or modern biotechnology breeding of crops with higher level of vitamins and minerals or higher protein and healthier fat plant breeding is undertaken for improved nutritional variety of the plants so now question arises why are we improving the varieties so firstly we will be talking about objectives of improving first is protein content and quality second is oil content and quality third is micronutrient and mineral content and fourth is vitamin content Now it is an important tool to fight the hidden hunger that is micronutrient malnutrition biofortified crops in india and their future prospects madhuban gajar carrot developed through the selection method with iron content 276.7 mg per kg and higher beta carotene content 277.75 mg per kg transforming indian thali into nutri thali The 17 recently developed biofortified varieties of 8 crops to be dedicated to the nation by the prime minister will have to be 3.0 fold increase in nutritional value. The rice variety CR Dhan 315 has higher zinc content, wheat variety HI 1633 rich in protein, iron and zinc, HD 3298 rich in protein and iron content. and dbw303 and ddw48 rich in protein in wheat ladowal quality protein maize hybrid 1 2 and 3 rich in lysine and tryptophan cfmv of 1 and 2 of finger millet rich in calcium iron and zinc clmv1 of little millet rich in iron and zinc pusa mustard 32 rich in uracic acid girnar 4 and 5 of groundnut with enhanced oleic acid and yam variety shri nilima and da340 with enhanced zinc iron and anthocyanin content now these varieties along with other food ingredients will transform the normal indian thali into nutri thali now we'll be talking about the future prospects of biofortified varieties first is raise awareness on lack of awareness on the health benefits of biofortified varieties one of the factor for slow adoption of biofortified varieties second is policy support strengthening the seed chain to produce and supply good quality seeds is an important step for the popularization of biofortified varieties of different crops third is research innovation technology to reach from lab to land finally the conclusion is biofortified variety is the new concept and the need of the hour as our country india rank in hunger global index ghi 2019 as ranked 102 among 117 countries the ghi 2020 report has placed india into 94th position among 107 countries much behind bangladesh pakistan and nepal the situation is grim and the country is battling widespread hunger along with agriculture is the backbone of our economy and with the introduction of biofortified varieties more income avenues can be open to the farmers and for more agri knowledge keep watching krishi jagran thank you